Welcome to the video guys. Um, today I'm going to be talking about the picks I use because um, I get these questions all the time and um, I really don't use a specific pick every single day. It's just whatever's closest to me. So I generally just use whatever um, feels comfortable in that day and whatever style I'm playing too. That has a big part to do with it. It's not like I can just use one pick for everything. It's it's usually about three to five different picks, and I'll be demonstrating that in this video. Okay, guys, pick number five. It's a uh, Dunlop Tortex .73 millimeter. I love this pick. I've used it for so many years, it's so dear to my heart. It's not my main pick just because um, it's too thin for my picking style. It doesn't agree to me with the higher string picking stuff, and. If you know me from previous videos, I do quite a lot of that, like this kind of... It sounds okay. It has that snap. And mainly why I like this pick is because it reacts beautiful on the low strings. It has that strat spank when you get that uh, kind of muted uh, low string kind of... That kind of sound. Yep, I love it. But mainly for like bluesy, kind of Hendrixy, Stevie Ray Vaughan. sound for it. I love it. So I recommend you buy this pick because I love it and so many other people do. So get yourself a Dunlop Tortex 0.73 millimeter. the sound of that pick. Pick number four. Now this is a Red Bear um, Classic M, I believe. Yep. And uh, this pick is another one that's dear to my heart because I've used this one for so many, 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 many years. I was using these when I was 14, 15 years old. It was, um, my dad actually was the one who turned me on to these and um, he gave me one one day and uh, I was like, I love this pick. It sounds so good on the high strings. Like you heard that line compared to the first line with uh, Tortex, the tone is so much different on the high strings. It's like, this is butter and the other one's like flatness and dry and it's just, it's totally, it's a whole nother universe of difference. So I completely recommend you get a Red Bear pick. I will put the link in the description because everyone I think needs to have at least one of these picks. So get yourself one. <laughs> I love this pick. It's a Jim Dunlop uh, Jazz 3 XL. And uh, yeah, it's a wide known classic. Everybody uses it. Especially you, the person I'm pointing to on the computer screen. You probably have one on your desk as we speak. So yeah, this is just a classic pick to me. Um, I've used them for many years. When I say many years, since like the first days I picked up a guitar type many years. And I have a close friend to me right here and it's a Dunlop Tortex Jazz 3, 1.5 millimeter, and I'll tell you what, I'll tell you what, this uh, pick is beautiful. It's basically like um, the yellow Tortex I have on the table over there, but thicker and better, and it has a sharper tip, so props to Jim Dunlop on this one, because this is almost perfect. It's, it's beautiful, so nothing but nice things to say about this Jazz 3 XL, right here and right here. Um, so I'll probably be using these for many years, and uh, yeah, go get yourself one. You probably already have one, so that's already self-explanatory. Moving on! Okay guys, this is um, number two on the list, and it's for a reason. It's called a Dava Pick. Sort of like a Jazz 3 XL type shape, and um, I believe it's made out of like nylon type material, and um, I absolutely love it. It's beautiful. I've came into realization of this company actually really recently through a student of mine named Eric. Thank you, dude. I love these picks, man. Um, they're like the best picks, pretty much, to me. Um, I have nothing but nice things to say about them. They're just great. Um, yeah, uh, I just recommend getting them wherever you are in the world. Yes, you. 
So I'll put a link to the website in the description of this video, so go get yourself some. Moving on! Okay guys, this one is number one on the list, and um, it's called a Swiss pick. It literally looks like a piece of cheese. I absolutely love these picks. Like, I love these picks. They're super, 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 super responsive to like fast picking. Actually, this is the same exact pick um, Rusty Cooley uses, so that tells you something. <laughs> but yeah, really, I do love these picks. Um, I'll put a link in the description of this video. You gotta get yourself some of these picks if you're actually serious about fast picking and all that kind of stuff, alternate picking, economy picking, sweeping, stuff like that. I just love these picks and um, I have really nothing but nice things to say about them. A dude named Pete makes them and an uh, awesome dude. Um, definitely buy these picks though. Actually, I was introduced to these picks by uh, Ben Eller actually. He was the first person to send me one of these picks. He, um, Send me them in the mail one day, and I'm like, love these picks, man. Just love them, so. Make sure you go get some! Okay, guys and gals, I'm gonna call it a wrap for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, Just keep in mind, these are my uh, favorite picks, not yours. Um. Not the person next to you, um, you get the idea, so just take what you will from it. And um, if you have any videos you want me to do in the future, just leave it in the comment section below and I may make it happen. So, stratting out.